Turkey Nail Art Tutorial by Hot Pink Zebra Polish. Begin by painting all of your nails two coats of a nude base color. On your pointer nail, begin by painting the black outline of feathers. This is basically just several loops going around in a circle, and then don't forget to fill them in entirely. Now fill in the edges with red paint. Red paint has a tendency to not cover very well and so you may need a second coat. I'm just putting mine on really thick so that won't be necessary. Then beneath the red add a layer of orange. The orange has much better coverage. I also am not waiting for my paint to dry, I'm just going from color to color. If the colors happen to mix a little bit, it's fine. And then finish off by adding yellow. Now paint the turkey's outline. So start off with a head and then have it taper into his neck and then add a fat little body underneath. Fill in his head and body with brown paint leaving a thin black outline. Now add two large white eyes with a dotting tool and a little orange beak in between. With a toothpick add pupils. You could also use a small dotting tool. On your ring and thumbnail, begin by painting the turkey's head and neck with black paint. The turkey can come from any angle on your nail. I decided to make mine go diagonal, so I started with the neck in the corner. Now fill it in with brown paint. In the video, I know the brown paint doesn't show up very well against the black, but it does, it shows up as a difference. In the middle of his head, add a little orange triangle beak. And then around his beak, give him two big white eyes. The eyes are so big that they go around the beak just a little bit around the corners. And they can also go outside his head too if you'd like. And then add his little red waddle off to one side. It's basically just a curvy red line. And then with a dotting tool, give him his pupils. On your middle and pinky nails, begin by painting a layer of clear polish and then adding orange, red, and brown spots in it. Taking a toothpick, just take and swirl it all around. Basic water marble technique. And then, of course, add a nice layer of top coat. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you like my design. Please comment with requests and subscribe. Also, check me out on Facebook and Twitter. I'll see you in the next video.